Hi everyone. Today I decided to do a sort of a get ready with me, but it's also my um, winter makeup look. So I thought that I would share with you how I get ready and the makeup look that I'm doing. Um, I know that with winter it's usually browns and stuff which I will have in, but I'm going to also put a touch of um, um, turquoise in because that is what my outfit colour is, as well as my nail. <laughs> so I will show you how I do it. So first of all, I put on this which is a primer, but it's got, it's a photo finish um, color correcting from Smashbox. Okay. And it's got a green, because I'm quite red. So I try and cancel the red out. And then I'm going to be using my um, BB cream. So um, I use it's quite old, so just the Garnier BB Cream Pure Active Anti Imperfections, and it's in the color light. <laughs> see it's getting old. And I use my damp beauty blender to get it onto my face. Now I'm going to just put on a little bit of powder. Um, I don't usually like putting on powder because my skin has been very dry lately or dehydrated, dehydrated should I say, because it's usually a combination. You know, I've got a combination skin where oily T-zone and the dry sides, but these days it's just been very dry everywhere. This is from Makeup Forever Professional. Um, I'm not too sure what the color is. Because it is old so it's gone off but it's quite light don't know if I can show you Let's see I'm just gonna take that same beauty blender okay then I'm just gonna take my um, matte fixer face spray um, I heard from Jacqueline, when I watched Jacqueline Hill, she said that if you've got dry skin and you want to put powder on your face, then it's a good idea to spray a fixer on afterwards. Um, so I'm going to try that because I don't want to look like a snake. Um, I'm using the Classic Queen. It's the matte fixer face spray. It's like a cheap one. Um, I don't even know. It's not even a popular make really. I'm going to do that. Now I'm going to do my bronzer. I keep trying to do this in my phone, it's not working. <laughs> okay. Before I put on the nose one, I'm going to do like a, you could say a highlighter, but it's not really a highlighter. At um, actual um, foundation, it's like a foundation stick, and it's by um, Bobbi Brown. And the color is alabaster, so you'll see it's like very white. So I'm going to put that on. <laughs> now I look hilarious. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to blend this in now. So, um, you don't like rub it in. You have to basically push it in. I'm just going to spray fixer again. flat brush I'm using now. The one that I used to put the bronzer on is this, this like 
little round one. And now I'm going to work the bronzer in. Okay. Then I'm going to put on my blush. I have a cream blush. It's from Anique. And it is Orchid. I don't know if they still have this, it's very old. So. This one I'm just putting in with a normal makeup sponge. Okay, so that's that. Then I'm going to do my eyebrows. It's also unique, but it's also very old, and it's antique, and it's a brown shaper. I do, I do this so that I can get the bottom of my brows to look nice and neat. Okay. Then I've got this eye lure from London. Looks like that. Comes with a little brush. Like that. And then I don't want it too dark, so then I take a looks like a mascara brush and I just brush over it. Now I'm going to do my eyeshadow, the brown one that I'm using, it's from um, LA Girl and it's smoky and this is what it looks like in there, this kind of, so first thing I'm going to put in, put on the, the this colour. check the time but where's my cell phone means I'm recording on my cell phone <laughs> one moment <laughs> so I've got on the light colour okay, so I'm first gonna go for the mauve colour which is this one over here show you that one over there and then I'm gonna go for that one Okay, so now I'm going to add in the uh, turquoise colour that I was, was going to put in. Okay, so this one is one of the cheap makes from, you know, like a, um, a brand from a um, chemist or a drugstore, drugstore brand. Uh, it's called Raylo and it's Raylo Cosmetics. Those colours. I'm going to put on this colour here. This one now is very pigmented, so I have to knock that one off. Now I need to just do the bottom. I'm first going to take that mauve colour. Okay, then I'm going to take the darker brown colour. this brush. The other one came with the palette. Now I'm going to do the turquoise one. I'm going to use a little bit of a liner. I'm sorry, this liner is from Essence, one of my favorite brands. Long lasting eye pencil in 22 turquoise.
Okay, now I'm going to do my inner corner. Wait, I'm sorry, I'm also using the um, Essence Long Lasting Stace La Vie. Just take one of these little, little things. Now, I'm going to do my um, highlighter. I've got this one which is um, Doo 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 Girl. I think it's, it's a Doo Doo Girl. Uh, Doo Doo Girl Professional Makeup. So it's two tone. I'm going to use the I'm going to use the white one. So I take the edge of my um, Beauty Blender and I Put it over here. Okay, so now I'm just going to blend it in a little bit. I'm going to spray the setting spray again. And now I'm going to do my mascara. So I'm using um, Wet n Wild mascara. It comes in, um, okay, it's got two thingies. So there's lash fibers and mascara one. So I usually hold them like this in my hand. So you put the mascara on first. I only use this on my top lashes. I take them. And then I put another last layer of this on. Then I need to do the bottom lashes, which I don't use the same one. I use um, Catrice Cosmetics Glam and Doll False Lashes Mascara, which is this one. I think I also got this one, um, this skin. The brush looks like that. And then my, um, actually it's my last little touch that I do. Sorry. Which I forgot almost. Is my inner waterline, which I like to put with black. Okay, um, the one that I'm using, surprise, surprise, <laughs> is Essence Long Lasting Eye Pencil in Black Fever. As you can see, I love Essence. They have very good make. One of these days I'm going to do a video where I show you my makeup box. So you can look out for that one. I don't have a, I'm not one of those lucky people that have a, um, dressing table so I usually stand in the bathroom and do my makeup or I'm um, trying to do other plans with it so the liner that I'm using is Elizabeth Arden uh, in natural okay. I'll have to do my cupid's bow first just so I can get that it's not like other people that have perfect little lips Sorry, the camera went off. Alright, the lip gloss that I'm going to use is um, 
well not yeah, lip gloss is from Elmay. I showed it in my um, what's in my bag. It's the Elmay Goddess Gloss in the Ethereal, I think it was. Yes, Ethereal color. It's gonna give it a bit of a blue. So that's my finished look. As you can see, Storm straightened my hair for me, so it looks very different to my normal curly head of hair. Um, and all the different because the colors washed out and it's busy coming out, so like several different layers of color. Anyway, I hope that you enjoyed the video, and if you did, please can you give it a thumbs up? And if you haven't subscribed already, if you can please click the subscription block. And if there's a little bell notification, if you click that, it'll tell you every time I upload a video. And my social media will be in the description block below, so you can find all of it over there. And I hope that you have a lovely day further. Keep your crystal on and your sparkle strong. Goodbye.